crescent moon it was a moonless night as I embarked on a solitary drive through the desolate, winding roads. The only company, the eerie sound of crickets and the distant howl of a lone wolf. Car the headlights cut through the darkness, revealing an endless stretch of deserted highway. The atmosphere thickened with suspense as shadows danced along the roadside. Ghost in the distance, a figure emerged, thumb extended. Reluctantly, I pulled over to offer a ride. The mysterious hitchhiker, face concealed, muttered cryptic words and sent shivers down my spine. Fog as the hitchhiker vanished from the rearview mirror, an unsettling feeling lingered. The radio crackled with static, playing a haunting melody that seemed to echo from the beyond. Ghost suddenly, ghostly apparitions materialized on the road ahead. My heart raced as spectral figures seemed to float toward the car, their eyes reflecting an otherworldly glow. Racing car panic set in as I accelerated, attempting to escape the ethereal entities. The car's engine strained against an unseen force, creating a nerve-wracking struggle between the living and the dead. Camera with flash flashbacks of a forgotten incident flooded my mind. The ghosts, it seemed, were connected to a past I couldn't recall. The truth was buried in the dark recesses of my memory. Church desperation led me to an abandoned chapel on the roadside. The air thickened with malevolence as I entered, seeking refuge from the relentless spirits pursuing me. Ghost inside the chapel, the ghostly figures closed in. Whispers echoed, revealing the tragic story of their demise. Confrontation became inevitable, and a chilling dialogue unfolded. Link unraveling the mystery, I discovered a way to appease the restless spirits and break the curse. The key to salvation lay in a long-forgotten act of kindness. Sunrise with the curse lifted, the chapel glowed with an ethereal light. The spirits found peace, fading into the afterlife. The highway, once haunted, transformed into a tranquil path. I as dawn approached, I drove away from the now serene highway, haunted by the memories of a night that blurred the line between the living and the dead. The nightmare drive was over, but the echoes of that spectral encounter lingered.